crazy. Hmm. Got anything hmm. to say about that? Hmm. 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 A man named Sean, 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 and his wife Carolyn. They do a vlog, and didn't you know it? They got the swag, and they ain't afraid to show it. Come on now, it's time to go. It's time to watch the bracket to your show. We are headed out to go somewhere fun. We're going out to the Sundial Bridge and we'll be showing that to you after we get our lunch but Sean had to go back to church and pick up some stuff that he left because he forgot to bring his water bottle home with him so I'm waiting for him in the car and uh, as soon as he comes back we're gonna be going to lunch and here comes Sean he found his he found his water bottle Sean found his water bottle is that your water it's bottle? My, it's my YouTube special Oh yes, it's very special. It's very special, it has YouTube. Yeah. And I left it here. He left his water bottle at church, but he found it. So off we go. I figured um, if you leave it at church long enough, it'll become holy water. Ah, ah. What a knee slapper. Ah. It's weird, this is weird. So weird. 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 <laughs> So Sean was making some funny faces and I didn't get my camera out on time to see his funny faces, but it was pretty funny. We got a good laugh about it. Horsies! <laughs> Look at that, there's horsies. Horses! They must, they must be getting ready for rodeo stuff soon. The rodeo comes in May and it's April already. Uh, oh, look dogs at that. and horses getting along together. Aww. How sweet. Yellow car. You got me again. I win. Yeah. All right, let's. Uh, There's some action going on over here. Turn around here. Yeah. So we're trying to find a picnic table, but everybody and their mother is out here today. Oh, looky there. A horsey. And a doggy. No more horsey. Nice white horse. That's a pretty horse. Until he wears a saddle a lot. Yep. <laughs> He's got the saddle stain stain on his hairs. So we're trying to find somewhere to eat. We want like a shady spot and we kind of want an area that it's like a little quieter so that we're not bugging people. And yeah. There's the they're river. not bugging us. That too. <laughs> so there's the river and there's like a ton of rocks in there because there's like no water whatsoever. Well there's some water. There's some water. But <laughs> Maybe we can walk on water. Oh, -ho. Ho -ho. that'd be kind of interesting. I wonder how shallow it really is. Like if we really could just walk across that without getting uh, too wet. I don't know. There's people in there fishing. Hmm. So, and there's a sneak peek of the Sundial Bridge over there. Yep, yep. That's where we're headed. Yeah, that's where we're going. Uh oh, no dogs in the park. You know what that means? Sean can't go in there. <laughs> what up, dog? <laughs> Sean's a diggity dog. It's an interesting car. Ooh, look at that. It's an old car. Gangster car. Woo! That's a pretty cool car. Hmm. Well, we're gonna go find our spot to eat and uh, we'll check back later. Here we are. So we are at <laughs> Cheese. Cheese. We're at the <laughs> Sundial Bridge. There it is. You should go cheese the other direction. And there are a lot of birds. Look at this. Wow. I don't know if you can see them all, but they're just all over the place. Crazy. But uh, so this is an actual gigantic sundial. And of course, it's a bridge, so we can walk across it. Mm -hmm. That's why it's called the Sundial Bridge. Yeah. But it's really actually a sundial. So we'll show it to you when we get down there how it actually works. Even though you probably already know what a sundial is, but we'll show it to you anyway. It's good enough. Nothing like a nice little picnic. Little sandwiches. That's right. Got some, some live music down there. Yep. We'll, uh, we'll show you that area a little bit later on. When we're done eating, let us eat. Gosh. I know we call you family, but you don't gotta be like little kids and be like, Mom, Mom, Dad, Mom, Dad. Just calm down. I want to 
want more. Come we'll on, take more. care of you in a little bit. Yeah. So yeah, we'll show that to you down there and it's pretty cool, a little area. And quick sneak peek of the Sundown Bridge, it all kind of works that way. This is the shadow that you see is from it right now. And we'll show you more after what I need. He's unicycling. They've seen just about every kind of bike or trike or whatever you want to call it, like thing on wheels. We've seen every different shape and size yep. and variety of it. That's for sure. Wheelchairs, we got bicycles. Let's see if we can, we got you know, big and small, there's little kid bikes. But then there's like different types that you just don't see every day. That you don't see them at the normal bike place where you would pick up a bike. There's like a Segway rental thing around here, so you pe see people cool. on. Pe la, la, la. You la, see, la, la. You, you see people, you see people on these Segways, and that's because they um, they like people? rented it. La, 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 la. You got baby carriages. And then you got really tiny little dogs, and you got these huge dogs in here too. No cats or uh, birds or well, you see wild birds, but you don't see birds that are like people's pets. But yeah, there's lots of dogs out there. People got scooters, all kinds of stuff. Okay, so here's the Sundial Bridge. If you can see it right here, right there. All right, so a big, huge thing. Now, the basics. If you've never seen the Sundial Bridge before. The basics are that the th big thing makes a shadow on the spots that tell you what time of the day it is. Depending on what time of year it is, they're a little different. Over here we've got this, uh, got this little walkway type thing made of little rocks, and over there it starts and it goes this way. You can see a little white line. I'll go up closer and show you how it works. This thing says, you can see the shadow here from way over there, it says that it's right about three. If we pull our clock out here, three, three. Look at that. It's pretty darn accurate, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Pretty accurate. That's right. So, as the day goes by, the sun moves the shadow right downhill. Yep. And there you go, a sundial and a bridge. Yep. Sundial bridge. Pretty cool view too. Pretty cool view. And it only goes to three o'clock in the afternoon, so the rest of the day is gone. Yeah, after three, it's just like, that's it. That's all you get. So it shows, shows, shows summer solstice uh, on June 21st. So on that day, that's when it should be perfectly accurate. Now I'll show you, like we can actually go around this little path that goes down, it curves around and goes underneath the, the bridge. And there's a little area down there, it's kind of nice. And that's where they're playing that live music. So we'll show you some of that. So there it is. You can see the uh, shadows from the from the poles that go all the way down and hold it up. Pretty cool. All right, so here we are down at the bottom of the Sundial Bridge, right in Running Gale Barn, y'all. So you can see here's where all the birds are hanging out. And you can see the people walking up there. Hello, hello. You can see all the birds underneath here. We'll see if we can zoom in a little bit for you. The birds are going in here, making nests. Yeah, have them, that's not on camera, but you know, we also have them on camera. Ha! The little camera right there. Security. So, uh, yeah, so there's a ton of spiders. They're orb weaver spiders, and they build their webs in here. I don't know how well you can see it right now, but usually there's tons of spider webs. They go in, they clean it up every now and then, but this hole underneath here is like loaded with spider webs. And that's because it's by the water, which we just read on a little panel over there, that it's not the bridge that attracts the spiders, it's all the insects that live by the water. So they, it's a good habitat for spiders to be right there and all those little bugs fly right into their webs. Fun fact of the day. Yep, that's right. And here, the water is usually all the way up to here. Up to the... Yeah, we usually can't even step off of this yeah. because there's like water that you could like, it's deep enough to swim in, but you wouldn't Ooh. swim in it because it's like river water. Um, but yeah, it's like Ooh. empty. 
People are like hanging out down there in the rocks. Yep. Down there in the rocks. People are fishing on the water. We've taken a raft down this river before, it's the Sacramento River. Hello down there. Hi. Should I jump? Don't do it. Ah, no. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we're in the Turtle Bay Arboretum. Is that how you pronounce that? Arboretum? No idea. I think it's an Arboretum and I don't know if I'm pronouncing it right, so you can correct me if I'm saying it wrong. But I think an Arboretum is like a plant area. So there's like all these plants. And so they have these little things here that tell you about what's in the area that you're looking at. So right now we're looking at the Willow Pond Trail, which has turtles, willows, otters, horsetails, raccoons, and elderberries. So that's where we're at right now. Usually in the springtime, which would be about now, uh, stuff should start blooming soon, but it looks like it's not blooming quite yet, so it's a little bare. But there's flowers in some spots. Like right there. Some flowers. And you got some trees. A giant sequoia. Giant sequoia. That's so huge. giant. <laughs> Look at that. It's like half, well, it's almost as big as Sean, but a little bit longer. Like twice the size of Sean. There we go. It's a better way to say it. <laughs> yeah. And so Sean's been getting attacked by bees, sort well, of. Not attacked so much, like really actually attacked, but they're just, they're like float in front of me and then I like move and they stay there. And I move the other way and they keep following me. And he's scared of bees, I think. I've never been stung, so I'm just like, I don't want to be stung. Yeah. I think that's my thing. Getting stung does hurt. It does hurt. Totally. So. So they have these chairs here and they have them in memory of people and stuff. And then we have some uh, interesting stuff over here. And I don't know what this is, but it's part of the attraction, I guess. I don't know. Anyway, so we're just looking around and seeing what's going on out here. It's a piece of a conveyor belt from the construction of the Shasta Dam. That's what it is. Ah, oh, Shasta Dam, huh? We'll have to go to that damn place. <laughs> <laughs> I made a damn joke. <laughs> Another one. <laughs> I made two jokes at the same time. This is actually my first time actually walking through here, but there's all these different trails, so we're going on an adventure. <laughs> bum, bum, bum. Ba, ba, okay, Arachna folks, here we are. <laughs> Charlotte's crossing. This is Charlotte's web. Oh, this is scary. Look at this. Look at this. It's a black widow. It's going to attack us. It's going to attack us. I don't know what side is its front end. Ah! He scared at me. <laughs> so we're in the Charlotte's Crossing where there's spiders and black widows and all sorts of different ones that it says on there. Like 40,000 species of spiders. Yikes, all right here in this area? That's crazy. Yeah, on the planet. Oh, on the planet? Except oh. for Antarctica. Rattlesnake habitat, watch your step. And there's a little thing there that's a rattlesnake. <laughs> oh, look at this. This uh, bridge that's is interesting. Cool. Look at this bridge. Look at that. Got spider designs. The spider designs, that's pretty cool. And there's some ducks in there, or geese, or whatever. Is that geese? Where? Or is that a duck? Oh yeah, that's uh, one of those Canadian geese. It's a Canadian geese over there. I want to see a rattlesnake. I saw something jump in the water. Something jumped in the water? Like a frog mm -hmm. or Oh, poppies. look at these. Those are pretty. Are they poppies? I think so. You can't pick them off. Uh-uh. It's legal. Look at that. Well, at least we got it on video. Yep. They're pretty. Poppy is the California state flower, so we can't touch it can't touch it? I don't know, maybe you can touch it, but you can't pick it. Apparently they have opium in them. Ooh, cool. <laughs> <laughs> I don't remember where in California, but I went to, whenever I went down to Mexico with our church group, they, um, we stopped somewhere where there was like all these flowers and there was a ton of poppies. And then there were like all these other flowers in there. Stack and they were rocks. like really different colors and cool. It was awesome. Look at these rocks. 
Do you want to build a snow rock thing? Want to build a rock pile? Rock pile? That one's got like a little rock teeny piles. tiny rock on the very top. Oh, look at that. Teeny tiny little rock. Boop. Oh, we're still in a rattlesnake habitat. Let's find some more rattlesnakes. Or some at all. Let's find one. <laughs> one would be cool. Huh, you guys want to see a rattlesnake? I wish we could, but um, we may, we may not. We'll see. So here's a turtle just floating in the water. Turtle, turtle, turtle. He's relaxing. See now, this is a, a time travel situation because this guy goes back in time and becomes Michelangelo. <laughs> He's a party dude. Cool. I don't know if you can see, but like right above him, there's, there's Leonardo floating out. Oh, yeah. We found this monument. We're gonna take a look at it. Looks pretty cool. Three rocks and, and then a water, water fountain. Fall thing. Water fountain fall. See what it says here. Yeah. Google it says we use 70% of our fresh water for agriculture. Water, liquid gold. Without water, there's no work. Water is life. We use 20% for industry. Eagle splash left. Those are the waters coming out of the rock right there. Huh. huh. Eagle slosh left. Yeah, Slosh like a, the water. Like a cut right there, and then the water's coming out. Yeah. Like a kind of little pipe Ooh, right there. Huh. Yeah. Cool. Look at that. And then the water just flows down here, down here, down there, and then it bubbles up right there. And then right here, it trickles down into here, all the way down there, and then there's this little moat area right along here. And all that water goes into there. Crazy. Hmm. Got anything hmm. to say about that? Hmm. 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 There's a salmon and a garter steak and a salamander and some shrimp and a mayfly and a rotifers. I don't know what that is. But those are kind of cool. Then that way you kind of know what's going on. Look at this water. Goldfish. Oh, look at all those little goldfishies. Just look at them. See? Look at them. See the goldfish? That's pretty cool. We found the little thingy bubber that talks about the sculpture that we were looking at. So it's called Sounds of Water. And it's a place for you to cool yourself. A place to contemplate and learn about water. Which is true because there's like water facts all over the concrete thingy bubbers. So there's a nice little story about that. Very cool. I like this little picture here. It's like a microscopic view of pure water and then a microscopic view of polluted water. What a difference. So is this polluted or is this clear water? <laughs> <laughs> There's a lot of leaves in there. A lot of random facts. Yeah, pretty awesome. Whew, we just finished our exercising for the day walking through that arboretum and through Turtle Bay. And now we're sweaty. And ready to drink a lot of water. I wasn't even expecting to get all that exercise. <laughs> yeah. I thought we were just gonna come to the bridge and walk around a little bit and vlog it a little bit. Then we ended up walking some trails and it was kind of fun, but yeah. wore us out pretty good. Yep. And it's like super hot today, especially from walking around a lot. So, so we weren't expecting that either. So we weren't exactly dressed appropriately for all of our exercise that we had today. I would suggest shorts or, you know, something not so heavy like jeans on us because yeah. we're sweating like crazy right now and we wished we were wearing shorts in like April. Goodness gracious. Just like everybody else, tank tops and shorts and, and ponytails and all that sort of crazy stuff. Oh, goodness gracious. Well, we had a good time regardless. Hi, bikers! Hello. I said hi to the bikers. I don't know if they saw us or not. Welcome to the Bracketeers and Slate. And Slate. Thanks for watching today's video. We yeah. had a really good time on that day there. It was fun going out to see the Sundial Bridge. It's lo pretty local for us, but we don't always get to go out and see it. So we thought it would be fun. Lots of fun. Lots of fun. And all the animals and all the different bicycles and 
tricycles and things on wheels and people walking and driving and whatnot. Yep. Yep. So, if you didn't see the video yesterday, click on the little button that says yesterday's vlog. Isn't this a cool end slate, by the way? It's pretty cool. We like it. We it's my favorite. It. Favorite. Favorite end slate. So, click the yesterday's vlog to watch yesterday's vlog. Click on the question mark to watch a random vlog, which we will select for you. Actually, we'll, the vlog that we'll have is from the Sean Loss channel. We actually went to the Sundial one time and we filmed it, um, getting some exercise out there and stuff. So it's a little bit of different footage if you wanted to see a little bit more of that place. Um, go ahead and click on that question mark and you can watch that video. Um, also subscribe to the channel you don't want to miss out on our videos do you nope right yeah yeah click subscribe there and you'll be subscribed you won't miss our videos anymore okay thank you also check out our other channels uh bracket bracketology bracketology if i can talk that'd be great yeah sean loss which is where the other video is on the question mark and also uh, craft catastrophe on the right side there. Craft do it yourself tutorial videos. Lots of fun. Lots of fun. So check us out every day at 4 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. Unless it's daylight savings time, then it's Pacific Daylight Savings Time. But 4 o'clock California time. <laughs> um. <laughs> Check us out every day. We'll see you manana. Well, boy.